Hi there. I'm Roy. Are you looking for a quick way to tackle multiple choice or conceptual questions in EWRB exam? The one is equal to one trick might be exactly what you need. Today, I'll share some tips on using the one is equal to one trick to solve some multi-choice questions. The one is equal to one trick is a fast way to handle multiple choice questions without doing heavy calculations. You set all variables, voltage, current, resistance, etc. to one, then adjust only one variable and see if the outcome doubles, halves, or stays the same. Let's work out a few questions. Example 1. Using Ohm's law, if the resistance doubles while the voltage stays the same, what happens to the current? Now we use the one is equal to one trick to solve this question. The relevant formula says that the current is the voltage divided by the resistance. First, set the voltage to 1 volt and the resistance to 1 ohm. As a result, the current is 1 amp. Next, double the resistance from 1 ohm to 2 ohms while keeping the voltage at 1 volt. This change causes the current to drop to half an amp, meaning the current is halved. Therefore, if the resistance doubles and the voltage stays the same, the current is halved. Example 2. Question. If the rotor speed decreases while the synchronous speed stays the same, what happens to the slip? Follow the steps using the one is equal to one trick to find the answer easily. Example 3. Question. If a cable's length is doubled, and everything else stays the same, what happens to the insulation resistance? Follow the steps using the one is equal to one trick to find the answer easily. There are more questions for you to practice. Pause the video if you need to. To recap, 
But one is equal to one trick is a straightforward method for tackling conceptual or multiple choice questions in an EWRB exam. You don't need heavy maths. Just watch how the outcome changes when you alter a single variable. It's a real time saver for exam or quiz questions. Good luck with your exam.